Hey, what's up guys? I'm going to do a little discussion video about rituals and going into depth about the next anime since it's been revealed. And I hope the music's not too loud for you. I think it's just right. But anyway, I'll quickly go through the next anime. It's, got, it's coming out in Japan next spring. And that's practically all we know. Um, if you check out like Cyber Knight or the main couple, you see the um, poster for it. Which I don't really care for, all it shows is just the main guy, or girl, I can't really tell in this, with his fucked up hair like a bloody humour from this anime hand, which I never watched because I think it was crap in my opinion. And the two boss monsters behind, but that's all it shows. I'll go probably talk about the anime more in depth when we get more details on it. But yeah, I'll discuss some about rituals because I think we should have an, have like, an anime or more much more support like a like a pack based on rituals for example just because I think rituals are just good but they're forgotten good forgotten that's what they are this was the last rich card to come out in god must be forever paladin or photon dragon which is basically like a paladin of white dragon Basically, you know, you contribute special summon in the galaxy eyes, and when this card destroys, must pop out so it's a graveyard draw one card, which is, you know, which is great. But yeah, I would like a, um, like a pack, like Prime Origins going back to the old four, and I think that'd be great to have quite a few ritual monsters in, because I think we need new ritual monsters. I just think ritual monsters are good. They're just severely underrated. Of course, now, you look at their specs and it's like, yeah. You can see the power creep from the years. If you look at XYZs and like Synchros, you see how much more powerful some of them are to the rituals. Because, if I'm honest, rituals are, I don't want to say my favourite extra deck, because they're not technically in your extra deck, but they're like my favourite kind of of cards like that. I like fusion, synchros are hit and miss for me and XYZs are just bloody, some of them are just too powerful and shouldn't have been made. But see, you can see the power creep that's gone off. I mean, they released a ritual art type which I thought was great, but I don't know, I never, I didn't really like this art type Gishki. I never liked them. I'm not saying they're a bad deck, it's just, for me, I don't like the deck. But I like what they did, brought out an art type specifically summoning ritual monsters, which I think you need to have. Which is why I think Primary Origins will be a perfect example. Going back and bring out new rituals. Even two, three, three would be alright. I mean, I would like to see them make more ritual monsters. I think loads of people will, just because, you know, it's, as I said, they've been forgotten. For the most part, anyway, always, yeah, they brought up this, and they've got an art type around it. But not only this, you know, many people don't use them. Some people have that use Relinquish, because Relinquish is still a good card. It's one of the um, ritual cards that are sometimes better than, like, Synchros and Fusion Monsters. I won't say XYZs, because XYZs are just, you know, they're just too powerful sometimes. Especially number 101, it's like, yeah, great. I mean, when Dark Master's Orc came out, I was like, wow, this card is insane. But yeah, I mean, you summon, the thing is, you summon Ritual Monsters, they go to number 101, Shark Hunter, and take it. It's like, oh, I see. You know, there's nothing you can do with Ritual Monsters against XYZ. I'm not saying that Ritual stand no chance, but. Just a, you know, it's just easy to get around it from what's just such a, such a shame. Such a shame. Because like you look at these, and Demise King of Armageddon is my favourite because I love the artwork. And uh, just the name is just so, you know, it's just so good. Demise King of Armageddon. And as a fact, you can pay 2,000 life points to destroy all cards on the field. Sure, basically you're paying 1,000 more for JD. In arguably, it's harder to summon than JD because JD's pissing easy to summon. 
but you know, it's just one of those cards that it's like, yes, you know, this is probably my favourite ritual card ever, and will always be. And then you've got other ritual cards, like Magician Black Chaos, look at that, Dark Master of, I've been through, I love the artwork on this card. Black Master Soldier, you've got a uh, Green Queen of Oblivion, I mean, their names are so good, <laughs> I'm not going to lie. But yeah, it's just, I wish Konami give support. I want support for this deck. This deck. I want support to Ritual, sorry. And honestly, I hope they do. But I really do have my doubts. As I said, the new anime coming out and bringing a new mechanic. Which obviously means... Uh, it's going to be... It's going to be weird. Because obviously we got... We got XYZ, we got Synchros, we got Fusions, and I think it's going to be, I don't want to say light XYZ, but it's going to be sort of like a combination of levels, maybe, for the extra deck. Like, you have a 4 and 6, but they're not tuners. You make a level 10 monster, but you know, that might as well be a Synchro, mightn't it? I don't know, but I think the new extra deck for the new anime will be red because look you've got blue you've got purple you've got white you've got black and i think it's going to be red but i hope if they won't go next round i hope they'll be like rituals i would like them to be like rituals and just be here in the deck with your monsters i hope that's what it is anyway how long i've been talking for almost seven minutes I hope you guys enjoyed this discussion and I would like to know your thoughts on, you know, the future of rituals and what the new anime new mechanic will be. Because there's always a new mechanic with a new anime. So I hope you guys enjoyed this. Later on there'll be a I believe there's gonna be a speed of of uh, Mythic Heratics. Oh, as you can see there, Mythic Heratics. Yeah, so that'd be up hard to I'm just going around five, six hours, probably up before that, maybe a little bit after, but be around that time. So, make sure you like, rate, subscribe, and hope you guys enjoyed this. Let me know your thoughts down below in the comments, and I'm signing out.